welcome back to another video with Mommy's Designs and DIYs. My name is Norma Acosta saying hello from Ventura, California. And my goal with these videos is to bring you enough information about different businesses that I have done and I continue to do in the past. So let's get settled down. Today we're going to be talking about two different heat presses. So let me settle down and let's get to it. So today the information that I'm going to bring you so that you don't make the mistakes that I made Hopefully I can save you that time and that money. Today I'm, I'm going to bring you information uh, between two different heat presses. One I got from Heat Press Nation and the first one I bought it was from Amazon. So I don't even have the one from Amazon. I only keep like two pieces. But I, I, from the knowledge and the experience that I learned from that one, I'm going to bring you all my knowledge. And I'm, I'm going to show you the new one that I bought from Heat Press Nation. If you're getting good information through my videos, please give me thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and share my videos. I would really appreciate that. Here we are. This is the second heat press uh, that I purchased uh, through Heat Press Nation. And to tell you the truth, the first one that I that I purchased, I threw it away. The only two pieces I kept are was this right here it came in a tower and then it came with this attachment they want to heat press and this one works with with all everything okay this is like the brain this is that heats everything up like the motor and this is to make coffee mugs i still kept this one out of all the pieces because i i still haven't um gathered saved enough money to buy me another one for the, the money i spent i spent like 356 dollars it was free shipping so i figured for the money that i spend i'm gonna be able to do a lot of things i don't have to buy so many machines i'm gonna have everything in one but unfortunately four months later this one when it prints when you print coffee mugs it doesn't print even usually like uh where the handle is i have to use um after i take it out of the the printer I have to use use this little one to do extra work around the the um the handle and so that makes it harder on me unfortunately at this point I need to wait a, li a little more uh so like I said the other one is already tossed in the trash uh for $350 in four months it wasn't really worth the money I spent on it uh so this one here this is uh, from uh, Heat Press Nation, okay? The difference when, between the one from Amazon is that it was a shell that moved to the side. So you need you actually needed to have a table, like a, a five feet table so that you can swing it one side or swing it the other way. And you couldn't have anything next to it because you needed all that space to swing every time you wanted to lay a garment to print. Now this one here, look at how awesome is this. You pull out, this thing pulls out. Okay, so let me show you an example. You, you, you lay your garment. You put what you're gonna press, you push it in, and then you bring down, okay? With the other one, you needed to swing Put the garment, sometimes it is. It was so close to my hand that I used to burn myself a lot. That wasn't a, a very good thing. <laughs> With this one, you guys, I, have, I haven't turned this one on and I'm gonna do that right now. You turn it on from here, okay? So you go here, you go okay. If you want it hotter, you put it hotter, okay. Then the seconds, whatever seconds you want, okay and it heats up, okay? Another super cool thing about this machine, guys, is that once you pull it out, put your garment on it, and put your, um, the, the whatever it is that you wanna print, you push it in, and then you bring it down, and it locks. And watch, this is so cool. So with this machine, I spend $50 more to do this thing. It opens by itself. So if you are, for example, you are, uh, when I had my store, if I was busy with the client, I could leave my garment printing and I could 
can go take care of my client because I knew that this was going to open up by itself. Okay, the the one that doesn't open up, it, I think is 749 and the one that does open is only $50 more. Now, what I really, really encourage you to do is please don't put it on a credit card, especially if you have a credit card that charges 20, 29.9% interest, don't do that. The way that I was able to um, buy this machine is because I did a big job. So it was a girls' um, teens uh, baseball uh, team. They ordered me the logo on the right-hand side and then the numbers in the back. So I made enough money to buy this machine, okay? So this machine is $7.99 against this other machine that it supposedly has all of these different pieces. It's only $359. Uh, free shipping this one is also free shipping but this one within four six months uh it's gone okay so uh save your money uh maybe even if you can find something like like this used heat press nation at this point for me guys is the best the best company that you can that you can do business with uh for example the this part right here it 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 broke i didn't know that's the part that broke the only thing i knew is that every time that i will push it down it will not lock it will just cut, pop right up so i called the company right away and they were so nice they said you can either send the machine back or we can send you the party and you can fix it of course this machine is about 80 pounds heavy it was hard for me and my husband to get it out of the box. It was already settled in one place. Of course, I did not want to send it back. So I I had them send me the part. The part came in in like three days, four days maybe. And my husband uh, replaced the part. And it was super easy to replace it because they they help you. They, they help you follow through with every single step if you need to. Plus the, the uh, instructions they sent are really good. So while this turned out to be a uh, a review and, and also a one, one machine against another machine, and I can tell you for sure, for sure, guys, save your money and get yourself something decent. Another thing is this one is 16 by 24. Uh, the other one was 15 by 15. This one, I can put a lot of more things in press. Um, so there you have it guys my next video please keep your eyes open because i'm gonna i'm gonna do a video that talks about how much to charge for your printing okay and i'm gonna continue doing other videos my goal here is to show you and teach you as much as i can so you don't make the same mistakes that i did for now for now guys thank you so much please if you like the content give me thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please subscribe may the lord bless you today and every day and have a blessed day until next time